All right, in this video, I'm gonna do some niche research for you and going over a few different holidays and then just doing a little bit of a mix of a freestyle to kind of give you some inspiration and give you that, 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 that good flow of knowledge on how I do research when it comes to just, maybe you're, you're stuck in a little like a slump and you, you just don't have no research ideas. Maybe this can help you. So let's get into the content. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. All right, so here is a quick little update. I'm not sure if you guys are aware of this, but the t-shirts are, so for example, example, this is a t-shirt, but the t-shirts are now starting to say arrives after Christmas. So this may influence sales. So if you see like a decrease in sales, cause I know like right now in Q4 and leading up to Christmas, like there are a ton of sales. This is the busiest time of the year for a lot of online businesses, but with Amazon merch or just any, like it's the deadline, right? It's coming up and, and most of the time, if you're, you know, if you're just selling only on Amazon merch, you're going to see a decline in sales because the products are arriving after Christmas now. All right. So I am inside of merch and former, I came over here to product research and then came over here to movers and shakers. Now movers and shakers is one of my favorite features inside of merch and former. If you don't know what merch and former is, it's like an all in one Amazon merch amazon.com research tool to help you come up with design ideas i'm gonna have my affiliate link down below in the description so check that out with a coupon code there's a free trial too as well but my thing is i i just want to put this together because I'm, I'm just coming come here and do like a freestyle with research i don't have nothing i know exactly what holidays are coming up because i've been doing it for the last six years as far as research and and designing and all that fun stuff but this right here as far as this, we're gonna try to come in here we're gonna use merch movers and shakers and then come in here and see what niches we're gonna find. We're just gonna just gonna dissect this whole front page and come up with different ideas. So we're looking at keywords too. And this is this is this is interesting because like so sarcastic clause, obviously it's a Christmas matching, you know, this is a, this is actually a good idea. But you're looking at the sales for this example. Now this is a little bit too late, but it can still be designed for for next year. So keep that in mind. Anything that I'm sharing with you in this video, you want to make sure that, you know, it, it's not saying that it's too late because it's always going to come around next year. But as of right now, it is too late. But next year it's going to come around. So maybe you want to just kind of upload that design, save that design for next year. And when it comes Christmas time again, boom, you have it out there. I can't. I work today. I can't. I work today. My arm is in a cast. It's a fishing niche. Let's go down a little bit more here. So you hate oil and gas. Tell me more about your horse and buggy oil rig oil field worker. Interesting. So that's what I was trying to do. Just trying to find this like unique niches. So like oil rig oil field worker. I think so looking at this right here, the oil, like the oil field worker, that niche right there is probably, there's probably a high demand for that. So if I would come over here to amazon.com, okay. We're leveraging amazon.com and you know, and merch informer. So like if, when I do research, I enjoy coming back over here because I am trying to find out like looking at the, these BSRs, what type of demand there is. Look at the, like the competition, the, you know what I mean? Just looking at well, when I search that, I'm not sure if this is 286, 282. Interesting. I'm not sure if that's correct or not. Let me see if I refresh it. Maybe they're just throwing these numbers at me to mess with my feelings, but that's actually a good, good first search. I didn't even think about that. Not for the week. Cause this ain't no nine to five oil filled shirts, oil filled worker, oil filled shirts pump it till it's quartz. Look at these BSRs. You can see that there's obviously it's Q4 right now. So these are cranking, but keep in mind too, with Q4, remember you're getting the most data when it comes to any of these niches. So all the data, all that information that you're gathering from these sales, the sales velocity is important for you to understand and, and like kind of take that in because it's like, there's obviously a demand in here. So next year when it comes around again, or just, you know, leveraging Q4 to create an evergreen seller. So for example, Let's click, click on this overall pick one. We click on this overall pick one. And even this one would be a good idea too. This is one color. It's not nothing too crazy going on here. But if we just come down and I want to see this BSR, that's all I want to see. Okay, see, there's consistent. This is consistent. There's consistent sales in this niche, right? Just by finding that one, you know, just by leveraging Merchant Farmer or just thinking of an idea, thinking of an idea and coming over to amazon.com and this, you know, just typing in a long tail keyword into the search bar as we did right here, oil field worker. Now we found a shirt with a, that's a top selling shirt right here. Now, if this let's say that, you know, there's a lot of competition for that t-shirt design, but 
Now look at oil filled wife. There's a ton that can be done in here. Like you can sub niche down into here and see what people leveraging the search bar here and seeing like what people are searching into this niche, right? So for example, let me just loop oil filled and then you can see the cats. Let's say like, let's type in, let's say mom, obviously that keyword's popping up. So like, and then let's say we put in shirt, leverage that a little bit oil filled mom you know what i mean see and there's not, obviously there's a niche for that so there's a ton that can be done here but just by leveraging that and working your way into that rabbit hole but like going down going back to the main actual phrase that we typed in oil filled worker shirt right here this front page is going to tell you a story and then you literally just come in here and like it's showing us the texas state and oil field so are they doing a lot of you know oil work inside of texas most, I think most likely they are. I know a few, a few of my cousins actually do this type of work and they live in Texas. So if you can think of like different ideas and understanding the niche and learn about like, you know, what, what where, where most of these workers working at, Texas will be a good idea, right? And, and that's one way to kind of just dive into it. Like now oil field in Texas, you know, they have something in common. I can obviously create a design like this person did. Like, you know, you can get the idea. Well, what can you do to actually dive into this niche and create a top seller? That's 329 BSR. So let's go back over here to Merchant Informer. And basically, so we're going to come down and just, I'm doing the same exact thing, just going back down to the next niche and, and figuring out what's going on. Cheers to a bright new year. New year's coming up, right? Obviously, this is, you know, this is a big niche, but it's like, it's cut, cutting it close. You can probably make a few sales by doing that, but you know that uh, new year's is coming up on the first motivated working determined dedicated multitasking the videographer camera movie film cinema cinematographer t-shirt like this right here would be a good idea catzilla and japanese sunset interesting that might be an ai design sorry i late i saw my dog i have selective hearing sorry you weren't selected today tomorrow isn't looking good either <laughs> PE teacher, physical education teacher. Breaking news, I have pubic lice. Huh, I've been seeing a lot of this. I think this is like a trending niche that's going on, going along. Let's go down, 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 down. Sorry, it should work. Cartoon robot, robotic arm funny, robotic here. Look at this one, deadlifting cat design squat. This is cool. So think about people that like to work out, people that enjoy working out, people working out and love cats working out and love dogs this is, this is a good niche this would be a good idea right here because there's a lot that can be done you got santa doing i think he's deadlift yeah deadlift the kung fu fighting niche there's another niche hockey player mom grandma great grandma just keep getting better nice skincare let's go down all right so we're at the bottom of the knee at the bottom of the page one right there but we literally just came across a few different just ideas despite just scrolling down and coming in here there is a ton of different ideas that can be done here i can i can literally dissect this niche exactly the, the first way that i shared with the with or is it at the oil field niche right the same concept you can do the same concept that i did here with that niche right there to every single other niche that every single other niche that you're seeing on the screen right now so now here are a few holidays that I'll be actually creating another video on this. So be on the lookout for that. This part one of, uh, you know, niche research for 2024. Groundhog Day is a big day that's coming up. I think that's February 2nd, I believe it is. Yes, February 2nd right there. But the sales velocity right now is right now, like it's trending upwards. And your Groundhog Whisperer, you can see, look, look at these BSRs that we're looking at right now. And we're looking at the BSRs. The reason why we're looking at the BSRs, we want to see that there's a demand for ground like obviously groundhog day there it is right now look at the look at it. leveraging christmas and then going into the actual new year into a new niche like this this will be a good idea 78k let's go down a little bit more let's get to let's see let's go to the middle of the page right there now we're getting to eight millions millions that's a little bit too let's go up a bit more but we're going into over a ton of different ideas like a ton of different shirts but the groundhog you know respect the groundhog the groundhog whisperer retro style on the groundhog Birth, so so someone's birthday on Groundhog. That's a good idea too as well. Anything with the holiday, like let's say birthday and New Year, that would be a good idea. Christmas and birthday, that's a good idea. Valentine's Day, we're gonna get into that next. And, new, and and birthday, any holidays and birthdays and mixing it that way would be a really good idea. My favorite holiday, I lie, deal with it. <laughs> I'll see you on February second, or maybe I won't. So. I was born on Groundhog Day. Okay? It's a good idea. There's a lot of good ideas. I was born on Groundhog Day. There's another one right there. So this is a very, very popular niche right now or holiday. And then it's going to trend over into the new year. So if, if I was you, I would start designing for this right now. Next one is Valentine's Day. Now, anything with hearts, loving, caring, you're going to see like the soul nurse, right? Like look at like 120, 123K. T-Rexes and dinosaurs and Valentine's Day. Like little boys, little girls, they love dinosaurs. 225K BSR. Happy Valentine's Day. You got that rainbow 
effect going on right here. Pizza is my Valentine. You can see what they did there. Food, mixing food, popular foods like tacos, pizza, cheese, anything like that would be good. Love bug, special. There's there's a, yeah, there's a, like a dabbing heart. Video games and, and Valentine's Day is really big. There's a lot that can be done right there. Is he mine? I steal hearts. My cat is my valentine this is cool pizza is my valentine's and you see we're going down the sloth 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 and valentine's day forget it girls my mom is my valentine's day same thing for sorry yep not your valentine's dump him all right next would be uh chinese new year chinese new year is the year of the dragon that's coming up next so keep that in mind so we know that you know there's going to be some sales velocity going right now with this 61k 100k 143k and there's the so it's lunar new year that's a different way of saying it so chinese new year lunar new year so it's year of the dragon as you come down you're seeing there's a there's a big demand for this right now there's a lot of sales going on and then obviously the year of the rabbit was last year so make sure that you're designing for the year of the dragon there's so each year is going to have a different animal keep that in mind a dragon or different animal different character however you want to say it but the year of the dragon is 2024 which is next year so don't get a mis don't mistakenly design for 2023 year of the rabbit you're designing for year of the dragon red is like a the red color is obviously like a it means for them like a good luck so red i believe that's what it means double check that though just double check that but i'm pretty sure that's what it is i have a few chinese friends that's actually celebrate this and it's a, actually a really cool niche so yeah there's a ton that can be done i can go on and on but just just want to do a quick like jump on here quick freestyle and show you exactly how i would do research and you know just going back and forth and just coming up with different ideas and maybe give you inspiration if you want more niche ideas watch this video right here for more niche ideas with low competition.